हाँ थोड़ा न्यूजीलैंड में जैसा कि आपने बोला कि ग्राउंड्स थोड़े अलग प्रकार के होते हैं काफ़ी जगह ड्रॉप इन विकेट्स भी होता है तो देखा गया है कि हाई स्कोरिंग हो सकते हैं मैचेस स्पेशली नया रूल चेंजेस जब हम लास्ट टाइम गए थे तो हम पुराने रूल से खेले थे न्यू uh, रूल्स के हिसाब से अगर देखें तो हो सकता है कुछ गेम्स जो वो uh, काफ़ी हाई स्कोरिंग हो बट डिपेंड uh, करेगा कि किस तरीके के विकेट में हम मैच खेल रहे हैं यू नो अगर एक फ्लैट विकेट है और छोटा ग्राउंड है और अच्छी पार्टनरशिप होती है बैट्समैन अच्छे से बैटिंग करते हैं तो उस सिनारियों में आप देखेंगे कि काफ़ी हाई स्कोरिंग मैचेज हो सकते हैं उनकी टीम में काफ़ी इंटरेस्टिंग टैलेंट्स है काफ़ी नए प्लेयर्स हैं जो कि बहुत अच्छा कर रहे हैं और उनका होम कंडीशन भी है सो आई थिंक ओवरऑल बहुत ही एक्साइटिंग लग रहा है यू you नो know, ऐसा लग रहा है कि बहुत ही एक्साइटिंग सीरीज़ होगी सो लेट्स होप फॉर द बेस्ट एंड जहाँ तक एक्सपीरियंस की बात की जाए तो येस नेक्स्ट वर्ल्ड कप ऑस्ट्रेलिया और न्यूजीलैंड में होने वाला है तो यू नो मोस्ट ऑफ द प्लेयर्स विल गेट अ फील कि किस तरीके के विकेट्स होंगे यू नो स्पेशली जब मैं पहली बार न्यूजीलैंड गया था तो फील्डिंग पोजीशन बहुत ज़्यादा कंफ्यूजिंग हो गया था क्योंकि ग्राउंड्स के शेप बहुत अनयूजल है तो एक्चुअली जो आप एक शॉर्ट फाइन लेग रखते थे वो हमें इतना वाइड लगता पड़ता था कि फ्रॉम द विकेट कीपिंग एंगल वो लगता था कि स्क्वायर लिंग में खड़ा है बट समो बॉल उसके ही पास जाता था तो एडजस्ट करने में थोड़ा टाइम लगता है सो ओवरऑल इट विल बी अ गुड एक्सपोजर वेल अगर आप देखें तो साउथ अफ्रीका भी लास्ट सीरीज़ में हम हारे उसके पहले अगर इंग्लैंड और ऑस्ट्रेलिया की जो सीरीज़ थी उसमें हमने अच्छा नहीं किया था उसके अलावा आप देखें तो जहाँ पे भी गए हम वी हैव डन रियली वेल जब हम वेस्ट इंडीज़ गए थे इनफैक्ट न्यूजीलैंड गए थे या साउथ अफ्रीका भी गए थे तो हमने अच्छा किया है आई थिंक ये एक टैग है जो हमारे साथ अक्सर जोड़ दिया जाता है एंड आई थिंक यू नो यू गाइज जस्ट लव इट यू नो बोलने में भी अच्छा लगता है आई थिंक बट फॉर अस एज अ टीम यू नो वी वॉन्ट टू डू वेल इनफैक्ट अगर साउथ अफ्रीका भी देखें तो जो टो टो टेस्ट मैच की सीरीज थी उसमें हमने काफ़ी अच्छा खेला यस हम सेकेंड टेस्ट हार गए थे जो कि एक पर्टिकुलर जो दो ढाई घंटे का सेशन था उसमें हमने कुछ ज़्यादा ही खराब क्रिकेट खेला जिसके कारण वी आर ऑन द रिसीविंग एंड अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट आई थिंक काफ़ी अच्छा रहा है हमारा टॉस हम जब गए हैं बट येस आई थिंक वन ऑफ द मेन रीजन बाई वी आर सींग दैट इज यू नो बिकॉज ऑफ द लास्ट सीरीज दैट यू प्लेड इन इंग्लैंड एंड ऑस्ट्रेलिया well i think the good thing is uh, there have been quite a few uh, changes but you know before we went for the last tour uh, we got enough time in india you know quite a few of them played uh, quite a few test matches in india they have done well so uh, you know they are confident about their ability and at the same time you know what i feel is uh, very important is you know once we are touring abroad you know it's very important as an individual not to think too much about the technique you know because often uh, that's a trap that you know some of the cricketers fall into yes you want to tune up your game a bit you know tinker around a bit but at the same time you know your basics will still be your basics so it's important to back your strength uh, at the same time be uh, you know play expressive cricket you know if there's a shot uh, that you play which is your strength and if it's there you know you should still go for it so uh, it's all about backing yourself and you know backing each other at the same time and I think that was one area where we did really well in the last uh, foreign series that we played in in South Africa, especially in the test matches. And about the leeway, I think uh, you know quite a few people were speculative about you know how the batsmen will do, how the bowlers will perform. But at least now we know you know we have got a set of uh, you know players you know who can do well you know irrespective of where we are playing. And you know that's a that's a big positive. Of course, there will be challenges. You know. and i think world over what we have seen is you know it's very important to hold your fort you know in in your home condition when you are playing it's very important to win those games you know and at the same time try to do well outside and that has been the case you know we have seen quite a few teams going abroad you know visiting different countries and they have also uh, lost there but i think you know more often than not we have this tag line only for the subcontinental team you know we don't talk about others who visit some of the other Uh, countries and have not done well uh, yes uh, we have a, a slightly bigger challenge in the sense you know when we play in india more than the pace i think it's the bounce you know when you bowl back of a length if fast bowlers bowl back of a length in india more often than not it's very difficult to leave on the bounce like right? you know you have that liberty of uh, not only leaving at the line but also you know if you judge the bounce if the wicket has good bounce you can leave it on the bounce so that's something that you learn over the period of time and i think the batsmen did really well in 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 uh, south africa when we played you know they handled good fast bowling 
and at the same time they were positive. So, you know, there are quite a few things that happened in South Africa that gives us the confidence of saying, you know, we have the talent to do well, you know, anywhere in the world. If you, if you see uh, how cricket is moving, you know, your 8, 9, 10 and 11 really has to contribute because uh, if they don't spend enough time in the middle means you also end up wasting one batsman, you know, it may be a number seven or number six batsman. So that's one area where we have to do slightly better, you know, even if they're not scoring runs, if they can hang around a bit of time, uh, you know, the batsman at the other end, he can still score, you know, what Ajinkya did in the, in the last inning, something like that. So if that's not the case, then it becomes difficult for the batsman at the other end. That's one of the reasons, you know, <clears throat> while you'll see a uh, few of the times, you know, the batsman who is at the other end, you know, maybe five, six or seven, they have to start slightly early, you know, looking to score those runs that the team needs. And in India, we have to take 10 wickets to win. If you take it, we will But it's important to uh, hold on to our heritage. As I said, home condition ka advantage le. And at the same time, you know, keep improving yourself. So when we go outside, you know, bahar bhi ja ke hum achha kare. Kyunki mainne aaj tak nahi dekha ki koi bahar ki team India ke agar test series haar jati hai to wo turning track banane lagte hain. So, you know, we should be proud of what we have. But at the same time, you know, uh, as a team, we should look to improve uh, so that, you know, world over wherever we are playing, you know, we give a good fight and, you know, we'll start uh, winning more and more games, you know, as many as we can. You know, there's more competition when it comes to the bowling department. Uh, the reason being, you know, all of a sudden, uh, you know, we thought maybe one year back, you know, some of our leading fast bowlers, they had injuries. To some extent, that time we were like, uh, we didn't have so many options. But now with all of them becoming fit and being available for selection and doing well in a domestic circuit, I think uh, uh, they have enough competition amongst themselves. So, uh, which is a healthy thing to have. And I think, you know, there's one particular uh, condition where uh, I think we'll have to improve is, you know, the wickets that are uh, on the drier side and, you know, just have a bit of bounce on offer, not too much of swing movement. That's one area where we'll have to improve uh, when it comes to our fast bowling department. The reason being, you know, we, most of our bowlers, you know, uh, they don't hit the surface. You know, more of them are the ones who swing the ball and, uh, you know, bowl slightly up to the batsman, but at times we encounter wickets, you know, that are slightly on the drier side and you have to uh, bang in the ball really hard to get bounce and pace. That's one uh, uh, condition I may say, you know, we'll have to slightly improve uh, when it comes to uh, the fast pulling department. But overall, I was happy with the batsmen and the bowlers in the South African series.